My name is Judith. My name is Malachi. And we're your hosts for the 2022 Panther News Bake Off. I've heard we have had some concrete contestants this year. But we have a pretty harsh judge, Big Bubba. I'm Big Bubba. I don't play no games. And I'm going to show these bakers how it's supposed to be done. I'm Top G from Florida. I came straight from over the rainbow, and I'm here to judge this crap. I'm Buddy from the North Pole, and the best way to spread Christmas cheer is singing loud for all to hear. That's it. I'm Demetrius. I'm Demarcus. I'm Bartholomew. And we're here to cook. cook. Hi, I'm Dolly. I'm Kenny. And I'm Reba. And we're here to win. Hi, I'm Lucille. Hi, I'm Crystal. And that's Renee. We're here to have a fun family time. No, we're here to win. Bring, Bring the, the bakers. bakers. Today. The judges and I are looking for a scrumptious Oreo ball. Now, judges, take a seat. And bakers, get bacon. Oh, no, no, no! Hold on, Malin, I can explain how it works. Oh. <laughs> Alright, guys, what's going on here? Um, right now, we are crushing up our Oreos, getting ready to make some balls. Mm. I love balls. So what makes you think that you can come out on I top? think, I think they, uh, I feel like the light's up there, but it's not on Twitter. It ain't on. What is that? Tell me about the method we are using. So we kept some of the Oreos so we can add decorations on later. And we've mashed up our other Oreos and now we're adding the cream cheese. Okay, what ingredients were you given? Um, cream cheese and Oreos. And chocolate. And do you feel confident that you know how to do this? Yes. Is this something you've done before in the past? No. Yes, this is my, my grandma's recipe. I had a whole board. That's me. Okay, tell me about the method. Uh, we mashed up the Oreos, like we took the cream out of the middle and mixed it with the cream cheese, and then mashed the Oreo cookies in the bowl, and then put the cream cheese and the cream back in. So who do you think is going to come out on top in this competition? I think Kenny's group. I think they've got the most idea of what they're doing. I think so too. I think that this team will just blow the other teams out of the water. So let's get back to them. <laughs> so what is your thought process going into the world? Oh, you know, yeah. really gonna put the cream with the cream cheese oh, and bro. just uh, really mash, smash up the cookies and then dip them in the milk and salt. We're gonna get it. Right. And that's about it. How do you think it's gonna go? Uh, I know. I hope good, but I really don't know. We gonna win. We gonna win. So, what's your plan here? Well, cover them in chocolate, yeah. and then we're gonna take some of our extra Oreos and we're gonna give them a little sprinkle. Yeah, I see. I see. These are our Oreo balls, and we kind of had a little um, situation, so we don't really have chocolate. So, but we improvised and put some ice in. What happened to Kenny? Kenny had some issues and wanted to leave, so we kicked him out. That happened. He had to leave. Let's judge these things.
so too gooey. No chocolate. It's we'll very see, sweet. We'll see if they make it. Exquisite. Thank you, contestants. All right, next dish. Hi, y'all. These are our Oreo balls. We hope you enjoy them. Thanks. Yeah. I have to say, there's too much cream cheese. But it has chocolate and crunch. And a good presentation. It's a bit too crunchy. And finally, our last group. No, this one's for you. <laughs> what do you think? Very good. Perfect. Perfect. Not I too like much crunch and not too much gooey. I like the crunchy shell. It was a nice texture. You Poor mind presentation if I, though. Mind if I take a bite? No. No, you're not judged by the heat out of here. All right. Who do you think won? Marcus's team. Wait, 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 I'm taking wait, it wait, wait, <laughs> wait. Why? I mean, it was just perfect. Describe. It wasn't. It wasn't like too crunchy. It was about perfect crunch, and it wasn't too gooey. I'd say the flavor was perfect, and the only thing that was wrong was the presentation of the dough balls. Yeah, it was a great mix of flavors, and I liked the little holiday decorations. For our next competition, our bakers are decorating cookies. Sure hope they aren't too ugly. So what's your process through this? Well, first, I'm going to ice my whole cookie, and then I'm going to start the decorating. You're going to start the decorating? Oh, yeah. All right. How about you? I'm icing it, and then I'm going to decorate it and ice it. What you guys looking forward to with these cookies? Personally, uh, with a cookie, I'm not too concerned about decoration. I just like icing. Yeah. Personally, I like the crunch of cookie. One that's uh, gooey tends to stick to your mouth. It's not that good. Uh, I would like for it to be, I don't want to have too much icing on it, but I need to look like a traditional Christmas sweater. How about you guys? What are y'all going to do? Well, our plan is that somebody's going to be doing a um, winter wonderland thing. Someone's going to have a gingerbread thing. And then they're going to be working on um, a Christmas tree one with the decorations we've been given. And we're just trying to make sure everything looks perfect. And we listen to what the judges have to say about their cookies. You know how you're going to go about it? Um, well, I'm going to outline it first, and then I'm going to draw some stripes where you put those on there so it looks more like a traditional cookie, so you're not getting too much icing, not too much, not too little. Sounds good. All right, good All luck. Right, thank you. One minute remaining. Oh, well, i got to wash my hands. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. I'm done. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You're fine. You're fine. Breathe. Breathe, girl. Come on, Crystal. Bring your dish to the judges. Looks good, looks good. How about you take a bite? Take a bite together. Make it more happy. <laughs> I really like the presentation. It tastes like it came from Walmart, but it looks good. <laughs> it tastes good. Thank you, thank you. I can tell Just enough icing. There was a lot of effort in the look that you made for the print. It looks like a traditional sweater.
Good job, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Next group. Let's go. Mm -hmm. This is our ugly Christmas sweater cookie. Looks good. Mm -hmm. mm. Buddy, why don't you give it a bite? Mm -hmm. I'm good. Okay. Mm. It looks good, but a little too much sprinkles. All right, yeah. I know we really didn't meet the assignment, but this is our Christmas cookie sandwich, specially made. Wow! Ooh. Wow! <laughs> Look at that it reminds me of Grandma's house. I'm <laughs> oh. gonna get a good look at that. You like it? Does it remind you of Grandmommy? Oh. Mm. oh yeah. Come on, Daniel. Give it a shot. Take a big, big bite in there, boy. Mm. Big bite, please. What do y'all think? That tastes like a slice of heaven. Mm. No. That was, that was the best thing I've ever had in my entire life. That was absolutely amazing. It didn't meet, it didn't meet what we wanted, but it reminds me of Christmas in so many ways. Oh the, my green, God. the green reminds me of a Christmas mm. tree. These mm. sprinkles remind me of the ornaments. And the filling mm. reminds me of after eating Thanksgiving dinner. The cookies remind me of my grandmama. <laughs> They're cooked to perfection. They're not dry at all. This might be our winner. The market, the market system. The winner is the Marcus's team. Yeah. Oh, oh, good one. Is that? Yeah. Cool. We only take dubs around here. Yeah. Good job. Good job, boys. Hey, this is a great show of Sail Creek Panther News cookoff. Congratulations to the Marcus's Marcus team. <laughs> Thank you, judges. Thank you, other contestants. Congratulations for second place. Thank you. <laughs> and I hope you all have a great day, Cell Creek. Take it easy. Hello, Cell Creek School. This is your Cell Creek Panther News crew. And this is um, Cindy Thomas. And Mallory K. Gilly at your service reporting your Panther News. Here today, we will be introducing our um, comedy segments. And our jokes will be, drumroll please. Christmas theme. What is Santa's favorite soda, Sydney? I don't know what Santa's favorite soda is. Coca-Cola! <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching! And a Merry Christmas.